WooCommerce perfectly adapts to any chosen Utheme Pro style and can be further customized in the WooCommerce panel in the Style Customizer. For example, there are style options for the price, title and rating. Some of them can be styled differently on the shop and product pages. The options apply to the default WooCommerce templates, the WooCommerce elements, and mapped fields which render the partial WooCommerce template files. Mind that page-specific options do not apply to mapped WooCommerce fields. This is because Utheme Pro elements have their own style options. You can customize the price for the single product page. If the option is set to show the lowest price instead of the price range for variable products, you can also customize the From word. For example, let's change the text transform to lowercase. Additionally, you can set the top and bottom margin for the product rating. There are also options to style the product title on the single product page. However, as you can see, in my case, the color option does not apply. This is because I've mapped the WooCommerce product title field to the headline element, which has its own color setting. If instead I used the product title element, the color option would apply. Now let's go over to a shop page. Here you can also customize the product price. Rating and Title. Additionally, you can set the regular and sale color for the products on sale. Mind that these options also apply to the mapped price field. If the price should inherit the element style instead, Set the corresponding option to Inherit. You can also customize the rating stars. And if shown, the Review link. With Widget Style options, you can customize the link color of the title and the font size of the price for WooCommerce widgets, as well as the card and order tables. There are also options for the widget active filters. For example, let's change the border radius. And finally, there is an option for the WooCommerce notice. By default, it inherits its style from the UIKit alert. Depending on whether its background color is light or dark, set the button to the inverse mode. 